Create a button to edit data. Create button to write data to PLC. Creating variables allows editing data. Change the code in the PLC data scanning timer. This statement only allows reading data when the variable is zero. Create a function to edit IO file data. Add data editing function to edit button. Code for write data to PLC button. Disable I.O. filed in normal mode. Run simulation and check the results. Enter some parameters for I.O. file. Press write data to the PLC button. We will check the tag value on the PLC and on Visual Studio. For integer and real number tags, you can now enter text. Therefore, we add the code that does not allow entering text in the keeper section. For integer I.O. fields, we use this code. Do the same for the real number tag. For real number I.O. fields, we use this code. Run simulation and check the results. At this time, you cannot enter text in this I.O. field.
Thank you. See you in the next lesson.